Hello, this is Chef John from FoodWishes.com, and today I'm going to show you my French onion soup. So delicious, it would make one of those uh, very entertaining French mimes, you know, start talking to tell me how good it was. So anyway, we're going to take three onions, cut them in half, and then I don't slice, I large dice. And the reason is, I don't like those long strands of uh, onion with the molten cheese, you know, slapping me in the chin. That, that doesn't feel good. I'm going to put those with a half a stick of butter. There's no secret to great onion soup. It's butter, lots of it, onions, stock, great cheese. All right, you also want to add a teaspoon of salt to the onions. That's going to make the water come out. You're going to slowly sweat those for about 45 minutes, 40 minutes, until you have a golden, soft, translucent, super sweet onion. I'm going to add some fresh thyme and a bay leaf. All right, I'm going to put a splash of sherry vinegar and a splash of sherry wine. So that's my secret ingredients and a few grinds of black pepper. We're gonna add our stock. I use a combination of beef stock and chicken stock. And I'm also gonna put in a splash of water. That's so as this simmers, so this is gonna simmer for an hour. As that simmers, it's gonna reduce a little bit and that's gonna, you know, keep it from reducing too, too far down. And because you're gonna cook this on really low, it's gonna be just beautifully clear. All right, those onions are just gonna melt in your mouth. Uh, and don't forget at this point, give it a taste for seasoning, salt and pepper if you need it. And then you're gonna ladle it into a heat-proof crock, a piece of toast that just fits the opening, and real Gruyere cheese, except no substitutes. It's either from France or Switzerland. You're gonna put it under the broiler until it looks like that. Golden, bubbly, and amazingly delicious. How good does that look? Now listen very carefully. Make that soup. All right, go to the site, get the ingredients, and as always, enjoy.